man, it's your boy Young Philly, and right now I am joined with man like Hicks, and you are watching Foot Asylum Unbox. So, today we have... The Air Max One Grey Vault Foot Asylum UK Exclusive. Bow! It's pretty sick, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited about these. Yeah. Only because I've heard they're an exclusive. So in the UK, you can only find these in Foot Asylum. Now the cool thing about this is this is the original, the one that started the whole Air Max boom. Oh, serious? This is, this is the one, bruv. Is that why they've called it number one? Air Max One. So, it, it came out in 1987, right? Designed by Tinker Hatfield. Um, but a few years later, that's when they started to call it Air Max One. Okay, so when it came out, was it Air Max 97? So, Air Max 87. Oh, eight, we're talking 80. deep we're now. We're talking years. We're talking mum and pops' these days. Come on. Wow. So, 1987, it was named after the year. But then, when it got, you know, as big as it like is, the yeah, it was, one, the yeah. it was the first one with a window. So, this is like, this is this is history, like in a trainer here. Yeah, Philly, brother, talk to me about this shoe. What do you know about this shoe? <laughs> I knew that was coming. <laughs> you see when the one, you see when, brother, you see when that one kicked in. I said he's gonna ask me something about the shoe. I'll tell you something about this shoe. Yeah, this is a bad boy shoe. I'm not gonna tell you no history lessons about one runners bubbles. This is a bad boy shoe. Yeah, I've got bare colours of these. Have you? That's it, done. What? Wear what? these with the ripped jeans, you can wear these with a tracksuit, you're good to go. What memories do you have with this shoe? I linked a girl once. Oh, and uh, I had the navy pair, this, this, you know I'm not lying. I don't know about mads, but I know what trainers I had. This bit was red, this bit was navy, this bit was white. Right. Cool, I'm not lying, done, yeah? So you know I had the trainer. Bro, the girl was a catfish. <laughs> Did she turn onto a bloke? No, no, but she just didn't look like what she, anyway, that's another story, we'll leave that for another day. Oh. But I've had, Crazy, crazy experiences with these trainers. Um, Something that's going to blow your mind. Go on. So this was based from a building. What do you mean? This shoe, the, the whole inspiration that Tinker Hatfield behind, had behind this shoe was from a building. So it's called the George Pompidou Center in Paris. And basically what's cool about that building is all the tubes on the air conditioning, all your piping, your wiring, your elevators, your escalators, all on the outside of the building. So what Tinker Hatfield, when he went to visit, he was like, I want to see through that. I want, to, I want to be able to show customers that we have air in our shoe. I want to make it bigger, when at the time they wanted to make it smaller. Oh, you're talking deep, I'm not so, <laughs> no, you're not even seeing that. I'm just like, no, no I'm, I'm so in tune. That's amazing. Do you want to know something amazing? Hit me. Even though these are mad exclusive, that's what's happening. Go. They're going to have a chance to win a pair. Yes, you at home watching this right now, you have a chance to win a pair of these bad boy Air Max ones. Now, all you've got to do is subscribe, like, and of course, comment your shoe size, and of course, your favorite Air Max print. That's all you've got to do, or Air Max colorway. I've been your boy, Young Philly. I'm Hicks. And you've been watching... Foot Asylum Unboxed. Yeah, man. <laughs>